All your faces are the exact same. You're supposed to change the face every time. <laughs> Did I do it? <laughs> well, let's start the video. <laughs> When I was 275 pounds, I was so overwhelmed. I had a lot of weight to lose, but I had no idea where to start. The only thing I knew was that I had made things so complicated before when I tried to lose weight, I needed this time to be something super simple. I needed it to be easy to prep, tasty, budget friendly, and very, very easy for me to follow and sustain. So today, I'm gonna share with you a meal plan that I followed in the very beginning that does all of that. It helped me lose 130 pounds and keep it off for six years. And you wanna know the bonus? Yes. Because there's a bonus. There is no cooking. What? <laughs> this is a super simple no cook meal plan. I love it, that's my favorite type. Kyle and I went through a phase during our weight loss journey because we both lost 130 pounds and kept it off for six years where we did super long meal preps. But even then it was only like 45 minutes. But in the beginning and now we like it very quick and this is no cook. And so we literally don't have any time to do long meal preps anymore. No, we need it to be simple and tasty, something that we can look forward to. So I'm gonna share with you what I liked in the very beginning. I'm gonna start. We ate breakfast, lunch, dinner, and two snacks. So start with breakfast. Before I get into it, this is gonna be about 1,500 calories. I eat 1,900 now, but I'm much more active and I don't really have much weight to lose. In the beginning, I ate about this, and some days when I was hungry, I added a little bit more. But keep in mind, this is what I did because I had a lot of weight to lose, and I just needed it to be simple. So it might not work for you. This is my plan. Let's do it, guys. Start with fat-free Greek yogurt, the plain kind. And we chose plain because the flavored kind has a lot of sugar and carbs that are extra. So I flavored it myself, half a cup, and I chose Greek yogurt because it has more protein. So we start with that, half a cup of quick oats. This is the one minute oats from Walmart and everything like I said is budget friendly. So half a cup of this, half a cup of Greek yogurt and half a cup of frozen berries. And you can thaw them if you like. Sometimes Kyla and I would put it all together in a bowl overnight and then it would kind of be like overnight oats. Like it would get really soft and really yummy. And to flavor it myself, I always do but a pinch of sweetener and a bit of vanilla extract around a teaspoon. To be clear about the overnight oats, that was like rare when we got fancy. Yeah. Normally though, throw like it all in a bowl. the no cook, no prep is throw it in a bowl, mix it and eat it. And actually it tastes like an oatmeal cookie to me. And you can also throw cinnamon in there. Sometimes we did that as well. I would sprinkle the cinnamon like this. I wouldn't throw it. Like that's kind of <laughs> reckless, don't you think? Sass. Always with the sass. How do I deal with it? I don't know. And then if you wanna get really fancy and spice it up even more, zero calorie or low calorie chocolate syrup or any, like sometimes we put pancake syrup in there or the caramel. This is the Walden Farms chocolate. Seriously, it tastes like an oatmeal cookie. Like it is so good. And the oats will keep you super full. The protein helps fill you up. You got fiber in the oatmeal, fiber in the berries. It's like a really well balanced meal. And lots of protein with the Greek yogurt. Yes. And we, sometimes people ask why we use the low fat or the fat free Greek yogurt. We prefer to eat a little lower in fat. We do include some fats in our diet, but we chose lower fat, lower calorie. That works the best for us. Basically when you eat lower fat, you get to eat more food. Yes. Yeah, because higher like fat, like um, peanut butter and nuts and stuff, it's higher calories and you don't get very much. So that's why we choose to like keep our fats smaller and then we can just eat more. So the next thing is like one of my favorite meals. A snack is a banana, a medium banana, and a protein bar. 
We love these pure protein bars because they come in a ton of really good flavors. They have 20 grams of protein. They're pretty low in calories. They keep you really full and they're like super tasty. So this one is peanut, what is it called? Chocolate caramel peanut or something? Chocolate peanut caramel. <laughs> It tastes honestly like a chocolate bar. So it like not only gives you protein and helps fill you up, um, it's really good. <laughs> and bananas are like one of our favorite fruits. So in the beginning, we ate bananas all the time because we looked forward to them. Now we eat more berries, but we still keep bananas in every once in a while. Lunch. One of my favorite things, tuna sandwich and veggies. Tuna is amazing. Low calorie, super cheap, super easy to prep, and full of protein. So we always got the skipjack in water. The, it doesn't matter, flaked or chunk, whatever, as long as it's in water. And I always ate the full can just because extra protein and I found the full can kept me full. I ate the full can too, but I ate what was in the can, not the can part. Because it's kind of hard to chew. <laughs> Tell him about his sassiness. Tell him But sassy don't eat pants. the can. That's a that's a real safety tip I learned the hard way. In the comments, call him sassy pants. Okay, I went okay. to the I went to emergency when I was five years old for eating pudding out of a can oh, like yeah, like this. Did. A metal piece came out st stuck right in the roof of my mouth and I had to go to emergency when I was five years old. That's a true story. That's why they don't put pudding in cans anymore. I was the last he, case. <laughs> he caused all pudding to be taken out of cans. <laughs> That was sassy in training. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so a can of tuna mixed with a tablespoon of light mayo. This one is the Miracle Whip Light. Really low in calories and fat, and it makes the tuna extra tasty. Mix that together. Sometimes I throw in a little bit of green onion or place it in. So yeah. sassy's going to say don't throw it in. A little bit of green onion and a little bit of celery chopped up also sometimes I do. And then put it between two pieces of bread. We use regular bread. Um, you can choose whole wheat if you like. We just prefer the regular old bread. This is just Walmart great value bread. And yes, you can actually eat bread and lose weight. <laughs> a lot of the friends are asking us if we can find, we're in Canada, so we don't get any low calorie breads, or very oh. few. And the ones we do get, they're so small that we're like, we look at them at the grocery store and we're like, it's not worth it. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, we can get the Wonder Bread and Dempster's Thins here, and it's 140 calories for two slices. That's about the lowest calorie we can find. But they're really thin. And for an extra 30 calories for two slices, it's 170 for two, you get really good slices of bread. And I feel like they fill me up a lot more. So that's why we choose this bread. And then half of a cucumber, half a cucumber. I like this half. <laughs> this one a little stinky. This one's better. Oh my gosh. With this. Guys, tell <laughs> sassy pants. You're over sassin. Tell them over sassin in the comments. <laughs> and then dip the half a cucumber, slice it up first. Because that would be kind of weird if you just, <laughs> I guess you could. <laughs> I've seen people do that. I think I've probably done it once or twice. I've seen it on the internet on a few websites that I frequent. Again, over sassin in the comments. No, and they take the whole cucumber and they, okay. <laughs> Sass, it's not this kind of video. <laughs> and a tablespoon of light ranch or any calorie wise dressing that you like. We like the rancher's choice craft. And that is lunch. Moving on to dinner, a turkey wrap. So these are so great. Um, we sometimes use the lavash wraps, but we have to order them online. So these you find in the grocery store at Walmart, and they are the flat out protein up carb down wraps, just the regular original ones. One of these with three slices of lean turkey. This we got at Walmart, it's just lean turkey slices. You get three of them for 50 calories. A fat free or low fat 
cheese slice. They were out of fat-free cheese slices, so we have the light kind. So don't don't get like hung up on the store. We used to be like that. We'd be like, oh no, the fat-free's gone. This is only what, like 10 calories more? It's actually, it's the same calories, but oh, it has- Oh, the same. Yeah, it's the same calories, but it just has one gram of fat. Oh, okay. Normally, the ones we have are 35, but no fat. So it really isn't much of a difference. So that's a good tri uh, tip, actually, because like I would have thought the fat-free was lower calories. I did too, and then when I compared them, I was like, well, there's not really a big difference, so we'll just get light. And that's a great tip that Sass said, like, don't get super hung up. If you can't find something, just find the best possible one. Yeah. You know, that And you're don't light. get hung up that when you pick it up in the store, it says light, but it's actually pretty heavy. <laughs> you actually got to do your light joke that you do in every video. Whee! <laughs> and then, to add some pizzazz to the wrap, I put a tablespoon of sliced olives in there. I love olives. And two teaspoons of this Greek feta and oregano calorie-wise dressing to give it a little oomph. And then for some ve veggies and to make you really fill up and feel full and satisfied, I, I ram, I ram two cups of romaine lettuce and half a cup of spinach in there. You're ramming, you're <laughs> throwing, you're whole cucumbering. <laughs> and um, if, if your wrap is like everything's falling out, a tip is I wrap it in plastic wrap and then eat it like this. But don't eat so, the plastic wrap. Yeah, but don't eat the plastic wrap or, the, or can. the can or anything else that's not edible. Don't throw cinnamon around, sprinkle it because gently. Because sassy will be sassing you if you do that, okay? With the dinner, I always incorporated some sort of treat, and this is the Great Value Thin Crisps, the chocolate ones, and it's a 100 calorie pack. And the reason why treats are included in this super simple fat loss meal plan is because when we didn't have treats, Kyle and I always went off track. So including treats set us up for success. And then, the last meal of the day, and we've actually been eating this, this is a snack before bed. We've been eating this pretty much since we started, right? Yep. Like, pr pretty much for six years. This is our favorite snack at the end of the night. It six is years ago when you were 50. <laughs> okay, cottage cheese, 1% cottage cheese, and in the beginning, the texture for us was not the greatest either. We pureed it in the blender in the beginning, just until we could get used to it. But it's such a good slow digesting protein to eat at night. And when you pair it with, we do a teaspoon of this cocoa powder. It's just unsweetened baking cocoa. We like the Hershey's because we find it's extra chocolatey, but you can do any cocoa powder as long as it's unsweetened. And then a little bit of sweetener. And we do about a teaspoon of the sweetener. And then this is where we add in some of the healthy, some of the fats is peanut butter. We have used natural in the past, but this is so much cheaper to just get the regular old peanut butter. So this is just craft, no, great value, smooth peanut butter, a tablespoon of that, half a cup of the cottage cheese, mix it all together. It tastes like chocolate peanut butter mousse. It is so good. So I didn't realize this, but it's a, it's basically also a Walmart no cook meal plan. Yeah, actually you're right. Everything is from Walmart and like super budget friendly. Wow, guys, this is like, <laughs> all right. So I hope you enjoy this meal plan. If you want to know more of exactly what Kyle and I ate to lose our first and next 50 pounds, we have two weight loss guides down below. Exact meal plans, exact portions, family friendly recipes, it's all in there. We also have two low calorie recipes in Power 13 Cookbook, so you can check those out too. Discount codes down there. Watch these two videos. We love you guys. It doesn't have to be difficult or overwhelming. It can be super simple. You don't have to even cook. What? Or meal prep or nothing. <laughs> Five minutes or less for each meal. Ooh, love it. Love you. This is the Jumpstart Lawnmower. Ooh. Mm. Yes. Love Whoa. you guys. Peace it out. You disappeared. Hi, I'm back. <laughs> Bye, love you. <laughs> See you guys. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.